Birds nests in trees. Today we're going to find out about where birds build their nests in trees. Let's have a quick recap. Can you remember? Where did birds build their nests in different places? Yes, some were underground. And some are mounds. Some are flat on the ground. Can you remember other places? Nests that were in mountains and cliffs. Or what about the floating nests? Today we're going to build we're going to talk about nests that are in different parts of the trees. What about the nests that are built in the branches of the trees? Look how these nests are right on the edges of the branches. Look how they're balanced so close to the trunks. Look how these little birds are hiding away. What about the nests that are on the edge? Look at these little nests right among the leaves. Can you see how different the nests all look? Where else do we find nests in trees? What about the nests that hang from the branches? Have you seen the weaver's nests? How beautiful they are, how they hang on the edge of the branches? Where else do we see nests in trees? Right at the top of the trees. Look how high this nest is. Right near the top. Look how high the birds are sitting. Birds build different kinds of nests. They weave their nests, some of them. Have you seen the weavers building their nests that they hang on the branches? What about the birds that make their nests inside holes of trees? Can you see the little chick peeping out? He looks really hungry. Here's a tree swallow. Can you see him standing in front of the hole, feeding his chick? The swallows don't make the holes. They use holes that are already in the trees. Some nests are very big. Look how big these storks' nests are. Can you see them standing on top of this big nest? Some nests are very small. This is a paradise flycatcher. Look at his tiny nest. So beautiful in between the branches. Can you see how small it is next to the very small branches of the tree? What about community nests? This is a huge big community nest where lots of bird families live. They all live together. Just like in a block of flats. Imagine living in a big nest like this. I wonder if sometimes the birds get lost and can't find their homes when they're all so close together. We've learnt a lot about different nests today. What if you make your own birds? Draw the body, colour it in and cut it out. Then to make the wings, fold a piece of paper zigzag. Have a look at the picture how to do it. Then cut a little slit into the body and slip your zigzag paper into the body as its wings. Have some fun 